Mr. De Luck, the amount of Timmy Murphy, two Chief Song, Carl Wellen, three Direct Route, Richard Dunwoody, four is Lake Kariba, Joe Tizard, number five, Senor Albertruti, Jamie Osborne, six is Supercoin, Mick Fitzgerald, and seven, Teton Mill, very well fancied for the Gold Cup coming up next month. Norman Williams in the saddle. This is his first run since the King George victory at Kempton Park on Boxing Day. Here's the betting. Yes, the long-awaited reappearance of Teton Mill. He was 6-4 to four in the newspapers this morning, opened at 6-4 to four on the race course, but he has been drifting to 7-4. to four. There was a huge crowd watching him go around the pre-parade ring and then watching him being saddled, and they'd followed him all the way down to the uh, paddock, but uh, at the moment they're not backing him. It's 9-4, to four, direct route, with Richard Dunwoody on board. He's on a losing streak now here in England of 26 rides, so he's looking for his luck to change. Supercoin is available at 9-2. to two. He could cause an upset. Lake Kariba, 9-1 to one from 8. Challenger du Luck looks magnificent, but drifting in the betting to 14-1. to 25-1, to one, Senor Albertruti, and 40-1, to one, Chief Song. But and they're racing in this Mitsubishi Shogun Ascot chase. And the two greys set off in front, Senor Albertruti, and also on the left of picture, Teton Mill, who actually led over the first. Lake Kariba on the right of picture wasn't too fluent, then Challenger de Luck in the centre, in behind them Chief Song as they come to the second. The two greys jump in unison there, and second last super coin, last of all is direct route. Good pace up front as they head towards the third, the first of the ditches, and Teton Mill on the inside. Just got in a fraction close out, jumped by Senor Albertruti at that. They've set off at a pretty good lick as well. Two lengths away in third on the outside is Lake Kariba, followed then as they come to the fourth by Challenger de Luck and further back Chief Song on the inside of Supercoin, direct route. The Northern Challenger is at the tail of the field and he'll be happy with this pretty solid pace. Being set up front by, uh, on the outside, Senor Albertruti. On the inside is Teton Mill. They're stride for stride with less than two miles to travel. Two lengths away then in third is Lake Kariba as they come now towards fence number five. Challenger de Luck is just behind them, followed then by Supercoin on the outside of Chief Song and three or four lengths away is Direct Route as they head along towards fence number six. It's Senor Albertruti on the near side with Teton Mill the far side. Pace has been very generous. Three lengths away is Lake Kariba, followed by Challenger de Luck at the sixth and a mighty leap by Teton on the inside. Jumped into a clear lead there. Further back in the field then on the inside follows Chief Song from Supercoin and last of all is Direct Route about eight lengths off the pace. They're going hammer and tongs up front and this will be a real test for Teton Mill but he uh, really does want the pace on. Senor Albert Trudy taking it up once again on the outside. Goes a length in front of Teton Mill. A length and a half away, Lake Kariba. Four or five lengths further back is Chief Song. Just moving up on the outside of Super Coin as they turn sharply right-handed. They're followed by Challenger de Luck. And last of all is still direct route biding his time at the tail of the field. Travelling downhill now towards fence number seven. A plain fence coming up here and Teton Mill once again in the lead there, a spectacular leap. Out jumped Senor Albertruti clearly, then on the outside is Lake Kariba. In behind them Chief Song followed by Challenge and Luck. On the left of picture is Direct Route as they come to number eight. And uh, back in the field Supercoin, slight mistake there by Senor Albertruti and also Supercoin got into that as they head down towards fence number nine. Teton Mill on the inside is the leader by three lengths from uh, Lake Kariba. Then Senor Albertruti pulled wide there and trying to get back into it. And a mistake uh, by Lake Kariba. Slight one, but uh, he's still there. And direct route not that fluent back in the field. Well, Teton Mill is really stretching them. Coming towards the water now, number 10. Teton Mill about three in front. Draws towards it. Pops over it from Lake Kariba. Uh, he steals a peep there between his legs. Norman Williamson on uh, Teton Mill. He's going particularly well as they head into Swindley Bottom. Four or five lengths away then in third is Chief Song. Direct Route is now starting his move on the outside, followed further back by Supercoin. Then in the centre next is Challenger de Luck and three lengths away, Senor Albertruti, who's now last of all. Racing out of Swindley Bottom, back where they started sixth to jump in the Mitsubishi. And the leader on the left is Teton Mill from Lake Kariba. Direct Route is very quickly coming to the picture. Followed further back by Supercoin and Challenger de Luck as they come to five out. Senor Albertruti, Chief Song out the back. 
Teton Mill got in a fraction close to that but landed safely. Two lengths in front here as they race up the side and is still the leader Teton Mill by four to five lengths. Jumped at it very well from Lake Cariba. Then in third is Direct Route Hard ridden from Challenger Deluxe then Supercoin a long gap then Senor Albertrudi as they come to three out Teton Mill is five in front and jumped it well. Uh, in second Lake Cariba. Third then is Direct Route followed next by Supercoin Challenger Deluxe. Forget about Senor Albertrudi and also Chief Song. Well, he's spread eagle the field as they come around the turn here. Teet and Millie, six in front. The others are struggling. Lake Kariba in second, direct route third from Supercoin. But it's Teet and Mill by eight lengths as they come to the second last now. Draws towards it, jumps it spectacularly. In second, Supercoin, third, direct route, followed by Lake Kariba. Then Challenge of the Luck, and further back then is Senor Albertrudi. But have a look at this for a performance. They've got one left to jump. Teton Mill is 10 in front. The others are struggling. He draws towards the last now. Teton Mill draws towards it, steadies and jumps to his left, but lands over it well. He's six in front of Challenge of the Luck, followed then by Supercoin. Direct Brute is struggling behind them, but what a performance. He's back with a bang. It's Teton Mill who goes on to win the Mitsubishi Shogun by about five lengths. Senior Albert Trudy might have got second just ahead of Challenge of the Luck. Followed then by Supercoin, a long gap direct route there, followed by Lake Kariba. Chief Song is the last to finish. Well, number seven, Teton Mill, owned by the winning line, trained by Venetia Williams and ridden by Norman Williamson, has scored the most spectacular comeback win here after a slight setback last month. Put it all behind him and has won very, very well. Second number five, Senor Albertrudi, owned by Gerald Nock, trained by Susan Nock, and ridden by Jamie Osborne. Third number one, Challenge of the Luck, trained by David, uh, owned by David Johnson, trained by Martin Five, ridden by Timmy Murphy. Fourth Super Coin, fifth was Direct Route, sixth Lake Kariba, and seventh Chief Song. And Teton Mill is now joint favourite at 11 to four with Florida Pearl in the Ladbrokes Anti Post Market on the Gold Cup. Teton Mill, the winner at six to four in favourite. Second, Senor Albertrudi at twenty-five to one, and third, Challenge of the Luck at fourteen.